welcome to my channel if you're new welcome back if you're not i'm g and you can tell by the title today i'm going to be showing you my linen closet refresh so my linen closet in my master bedroom was a mess it really needed some tlc so i decluttered i reorganized i bought some things i took out some things and i just made it look so much better it's giving like spa vibes it's just it's giving zen and it makes me happy to look at it while I'm in the bathroom. So I don't even keep the door closed anymore. I just keep it open because I just love the way it looks. So don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. I make beauty, luxury, and lifestyle content. If that's your thing, then join the family. And yes, this is me from the future. I did not film an intro on the day that I did the closet refresh. So here I am, <laughs> me from the future. Let's jump right into the linen closet refresh. Okay, y'all, so I'm so ashamed of this. Like this is a mess. So this is my master bathroom linen closet. And it's just chaotic. <laughs> it's very chaotic. There's sheets everywhere, towels, disorganized, junk. Look at the toilet paper. Look at it. So what I'm going to try to do today is run out to Target, Home Goods, TJ Maxx, those type of stores. And I'm going to get like baskets, jars, new towels, just stuff to kind of judge this little area up because it looks crazy. So, <laughs> come to the store with me and let's see what we can find. So, I want to put two baskets up there. And then I want to kind of put in the baskets up there, these fitted sheets and like pillow cases and stuff like that in the baskets. And this bag up here needs to go as hair stuff. Uh, well, these towels, like, it's just crazy. So, I'm going to get new towels so they can kind of be uniformed <laughs> so i'm going to like do something cute with the towels go through these uh baskets and like get rid of stuff I, this box has been here since we moved three years ago i don't even know what's in there i'm going to get a basket for the bottom to put the toilet paper in and yeah let's go shopping yeah, you know you got me. Target and from Target I got these two jars that I plan to put like my bar soap in. I think that is so cute. And then I got these kind of swivel things. I don't know what I'm going to do with them yet, but we'll see. And I also got these uh storage compression bags so that I can put my linens in and kind of like save space instead of having like all of my fitted sheets and like pillowcases and all that stuff just out. And then I got the this basket from Home Goods. And I'm gonna put the toilet paper in here. I'm gonna play around with it and see what it's given. Cause I really didn't know exactly what kind of look I wanted to go for. So I just grabbed stuff. And I bought this basket to put my washcloths in. And then I wanna put these two baskets at the top of the closet. So we're gonna see how it goes. Um, I might end up taking some stuff back, I'm not sure. However, I have something to start with, so let's see.
that uh, first let me get that uh, first let me get that okay so this is like the soap thing <laughs> and i've seen a lot of people do this so let's see how it turns out i don't know if i'm gonna do this small container or this big container maybe i'll use the small one too small no i think it might be okay so all i'm gonna do is just put this open and it'll add like a little decorative touch to the bathroom or the closet I thought I had more soap than this. <laughs> so that's that. And then I think I'm gonna put my feminine products, so like my pads and tampons in this big one. Um, fun fact, these honey pot ones suck. They have like a cooling sensation or something it feels like icy hot on your your kid yet like it does not feel good at all i think it's supposed to help with cramps but it, it just feels really uncomfortable so i don't use those i'll put them at the bottom Okay, so then I bought this, like I said, storage compression bag. So I plan on putting my linens in this and then putting it in the basket at the top of the closet. So I'm going to see how that works out. I don't know if these bags would be too big for that. They might actually be too big, but I'm going to see. Yeah, these are way too big. Oh, sh yeah, these are way, way too big. So now that's not gonna work. I will probably have to put these somewhere else in the house. But I still wanna put my linens, or should I just fold the linens up? Uh, I don't know if I should just fold the linen and just like kinda neatly put it in the basket, or should I just put them in here and put them away? I really don't know what I'm gonna do. Uh, let me take a break and figure it out. <laughs> okay, so I learned how to fold up the towels. So these are the new towels that I bought. Um, they're just gray. I bought light gray and dark gray. And I'm going to fold them, roll them so that I can put them in the closet. So you start with the towels, you fold them in half like this. You lay them out. And you fold them in. And then flip them out. Pull it down just a little bit. And then roll and tuck. Perfect! So I'm going to do that with all the towels. And then I'll put them in the closet. <laughs> She like the way I dance, she like the way that I move, she like the way that I rock, she like the way that I woo, and she let it clap for a nigga. Yeah. 
She like the way that I move. She like the way that I rock. She like the way that I woo. And she let it come. Okay, so honestly, it's done. I'm probably going to edit the space some more um, and kind of do some like small edits because I want to get rid of most of the stuff in those baskets because I really didn't go through them. I didn't have time. So just for the video's sake, I kept them like they were and kind of like made them a little neater, but I need to go through them. So we'll start from the bottom. Don't mind this. This is just gift paper. So I have the toilet paper and that uh, bin that we got from Home Goods, and then I used the smaller basket for like additional like hair turbans because I, when I wash my hair, I use hair turbans and like uh, hand towels and stuff like that. Like I said, this is like my catch-all for my hair stuff, and then this is my feminine, femin feminine, <laughs> feminine products. Then we have the jar of soap, and this is another drawer of stuff. And then I took the small basket and started to roll the washcloth. So I have some that are in the dryer that I need to put in here. And then the towels. And then at the top, I have I folded some of the linen, and then I did the storage bags for the rest of it that I don't normally reach for. So this is stuff that I use on like a weekly basis at the top. So that is what it looks like. So much better than what it was before. Like total 180. So yeah, I've kind of been in the mood to do little areas of my house like this lately. Um, I will probably do my pantry next and my fridge. So that might be a little cute video. And I hope that this inspired you guys to kind of judge up your place, rearrange, declutter. It's almost summer now, but like spring cleaning, like just kind of get your stuff in order, kind of make yourself feel better. I know I look super crazy right now, so don't mind me. But yeah, look at this space again. I just love it. Just I love it. So thank you for watching. Like I said, I hope I inspired you and I hope that you choose to declutter something. Let me know if I could do anything different or if you have any suggestions. And yeah, I'll see you in the next video.